flat a black balloon leaving a 3 inch flat tail. The first four bubbles would twist to make the head. Twist the first 4 inch bubble. Twist the second soft 5 inch bubble. Twist the third soft 5 inch bubble. Lock both ends of the chain of the last two bubbles on one lock twist. Lock both ends of the second bubble in one lock twist. At the same time, you lock both ends of the third bubble in one lock twist. Twist the fourth soft 5 inch bubble. Lock both ends of the fourth bubble in one lock twist. We have made the hat. The next three bubbles twisted in uh, your body fold will make the hair. Twist the fifth 4 inch bubble. Twist the sixth 4 inch bubble. Lock both ends of the chain of the last two bubbles in one lock twist. Twist the seventh 4 inch bubble. Lock both ends of the chain of the last two bubbles in one lock twist. You have to roll the fifth and the sixth bubbles around the seventh bubble. Alright, the rest of the balloon is the eighth bubble. It is a ponytail. Here's the top view. And uh, this is front or back view. Inflate a green balloon, leaving a 5 inch flat tail. The first bubble will twist to make the nose. Twist the first 4 inch bubble. Lock the free end of the first green bubble between the black 8 bubbles and the rest of the black balloon. The next two bubbles will twist to make the eyes. Twist the second green soft 4 inch bubble. Lock the free end of the second green bubble between the first four black bubbles and uh, the last four black bubbles. It's a bit hard to squeeze bubble in middle of intersection. So take your time and do it nicely. Here we are. That's a front view, that's a side view. Twist the third green soft 4 inch bubble. Lock both ends of the chain of the last two green bubbles in one lock twist. We have made the eyes. The next two bubbles will twist to make the cheeks. Twist the fourth green soft 2 inch bubble. Twist the fifth green soft 2 inch bubble. Lock both ends of the chain of the last two bubbles in one lock twist.
lock both ends of the fourth green bubble in one lock twist. At the same time, we lock both ends of the fifth green bubble in one lock twist. We have made the cheeks. Twist the sixth green soft four inch bubble. Lock both ends of the six green bubble in one lock twist. The rest of the balloon is the seventh bubble. Let's fix all bubbles in uh, proper positions. Here's the front view, the side view. Use a permanent black marker to draw the eyes. We are making the witch head, so I guess uh, we can make it really ugly. Congratulations! We have made the head. Oh yes, uh, the ponytail. We can shape it a bit. Here we have the side view, the back view, the front view. And now I'm going to attach the head to a body. Here's the body that I'm going to use. Let's twist uh, about 2-3 inch green bubble for the neck. It's a seventh green bubble. The rest of the green balloon is the eighth bubble. Lock the free end of the seventh green uh, neck bubble between the blue shoulder bubbles. Let's secure the lock. We don't need the rest of the green balloon, the eighth bubble. Cut it off and uh, tie off the end. As you can see, it's quite easy to attach the witch hat to uh, different bodies. Uh, or you can attach it uh, to basic threefold hat. Alright, uh, let's fix all bubbles in proper positions. And here we are, our witch, the side view. The back view and the front view. There is one thing that uh, usually which comes with that's a broomstick. And here we have a broomstick. It's a side view, it's a bottom view. Uh, a witch with a broomstick is a good uh, combination. Uh, for the Halloween uh, decoration. Uh, we can easily make the witch uh, flying on the broomstick. Just pull the broomstick through the loop of uh, uh, legs bubbles. And if you want you can pull uh, the broomstick through the loop of the arm bubbles. Adjust and fix all bubbles in proper positions. You can uh, uh, use a sticky tape and uh, sewing thread to hang this sculpture from the ceiling or just attach it 
to the room. Have fun and happy